Start it with no gas to see how good you tuned it, bro. Oh, damn. Diesel. Oh, nice. This is running the bridge. So I'm gonna just close it up and put it somewhere to the side. Mm -hmm. like, as long as the sensor is connected, it's not really gonna change much fuel or whatever. You can run it mathless. Exactly. So then, because you have the little FIC. If I unplug it, it's gonna go dumb rich. Yeah. I'm gonna retune the whole truck. A lot of people do it. They they'll run uh, the systems completely tuned by the the pressure, or Ooh. like either vacuum yeah, map, or pressure. Yeah. That's how mine just is. use the math for like fuel economy and stuff. Exactly. But so. that's that's how mine is. It's just the um, math still reason to the PCM. Mm -hmm. The PCM is gonna start changing a whole bunch of crap yeah. if I don't have the math connected. Cool. It was just a uh, standalone, I guess, or whatever. Oh, yeah, standalone has everything. Math. I yeah. Uh-huh. You remember the, the the monikers for what people call it like speed density N plus. Yeah, all um, those. Uh -huh. Yeah, all different type of tunes uh, yeah. setups. It's like you use O2 math and this. It's like called like speed density or something. Don't quote me on this, and everybody's gonna start saying, <laughs> "No, it's not this. It's not that." I don't it's know. Like, you I'll, idiot. I'll go look it up on Google tonight and be an expert on it. So that's all you gotta do. <laughs> that's all you gotta do. Yeah. 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 You can see. Old school PVC pipe Crazy. for the intake of the. Uh, it works, my dog. But I mean, it was in there. Budget bill. So, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. Budget yeah. Bill, yeah. Oh, you kiss. If you All can right. see the, um, this is a charred size pipe. Got it perfectly welded. You can see, man, a welder. He, he did some, he did some work yeah. on that, man. Way more crispy than my weld. Said, yeah, your weld. Ooh. That thing was Flashback, <laughs> but you got to actually the hole for the blow off valve. Got all that whole charge uh, intake pipe. How it goes in there. It's gonna go through like the, this. Down here, it's gonna go through that little opening from there, come up. Like it's gonna connect. Yeah, you can do that. Show you where it looks like. Yeah. So down here. Yeah. And we have a reducer come pipe, like so that. Bam. Uh, a reducer little coupling. That's exactly what's gonna look like coming through here. Boom. That that intake uh, throttle body is pretty huge for this engine. It's under boost, so you may see a three inch pipe. And like, is that too small? It really isn't. Heck no, not I mean, even close. People say you can. I've seen people on the internet made more than a thousand horsepower with a three inch like intake pipe. Dang. Uh huh. So yeah. They say, yeah, it's, it's good for a thousand horsepower, so bro. Yeah. That's our goals. So. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> You're running 20 PSI, so I mean, that's what you gotta do. Blow it up. Yeah. But I mean that's how everything is supposed to be supposed to be supposed to look. All we really need now is order tonight is the 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 run from from the bottom of the truck, I guess from where it connects from the turbos back here, all the way that full run all the way back over here until where it connects right over here. So all we really need to do is just get that whole full run right there, order tonight. And we basically put couplings on. We don't have to weld anything. So from there, we already bought the blow-off valve, bought the boost gauge, bought this, this. I mean, you have so many different parts on standby. So right when we do that, this thing will be turbo. We tune it and we drive it. Oh, so, yeah. I mean, it was, it's, it's like time frame is only like, what, a week? Oh, yeah. I'm trying to say just a week it's from there. I know, dude. I want to really see this versus this. Ooh. That is going to be the beast's race ever. I'm telling you, it's like, oh, okay. all we have to do is just like wait a week. Just wait a week. Because I know everything, I'm still buttoning up some stuff on this car. Nothing real too crazy just running nitrous on it right now. But I'm not even going to run nitrous. I'm just going to just run an NA. If you can, if you can beat it. If, I'm not saying my truck will be yeah, slow. Yeah, if you can beat an NAWS 6, I mean, that's... That's crazy. That's man. still that's that's pretty good for a truck. This is a truck. This is an SUV. This is something you take off road and have fun. And you can smoke a WS6. I'm like, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be jelly, bruh. I might just swap this motor out into this thing. <laughs> swap a swap a Gen One into a Gen Three. Oh, it's so much butt hurt. So much butt hurt. Oh, everybody would just completely start crying. That kick you off the group. Yeah, that kick me off the group on Facebook. Yeah. I lose all my admin rights. <laughs> oh yeah, it's gonna be horrible. But ah. Uh, it's coming around nicely. This, this only took us two years, you know, not too uh, too long. <laughs> only two years to just. Yeah, it was worth the wait though. I know. Oh. Beast to the Tahoe, man. This thing is gonna be amazing. It already sounds amazing, but it sounds better than my car. My car is stock pipe, stock cam. No, that car is dumb. It sounds good when you get on it, yeah, but when you're idling, it sounds, it sounds, sounds like normal. a it sounds, it sounds normal. like a truck when you idle. It just do 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 do. Like this truck sounds better, but uh. Turbo's garage, man. I know, dude. Making original builds. Everybody else 
Swap a five three in it. Swap a five. I mean, I know everybody five, does three, that. What's, what's I have, new about that? Exactly. That's the whole thing. I like. I have nothing against five three. If you have a five three yeah. in your Tahoe and your your suburban, whatever you have, just cool. I mean, it's, it's going to be faster and it is way better technology. Exactly. But the fact is, it's like starting a YouTube channel. You got to do some original stuff. If, all, if everybody, all they do is straight five three builds and six zero oh builds, it's like it's not under, it's not original. Anymore. Exactly. Like no, I, I'm not building this truck yeah. to race. People are like, oh, you building this truck to race. You need to put an LS motor in it. I'm not building no. it. Right? I'm building to have fun with. Like, exactly. I know. And plus, it's a rebuilt uh, uh, called bottom end motor. I mean, exactly. no, the whole whole bottom end is completely rebuilt. Yeah, so, truck, truck only has a, yeah. Like 7, miles so it's really it's motor. kind of pointless to really get a brand new engine and it's throw it out for to, to swap in a, a used truck motor. Exactly, like one hundred fifty thousand yeah, miles. One hundred fifty thousand miles <laughs> truck <laughs> motor. It. It's kind of pointless. So we kind of got backed into the wall to actually use a stock engine. That's the only reason we're using that. Mm -hmm. And it's a budget build too. A lot of people have L thirty ones or the the five seven Vortec. Uh, motors, but they really don't know where they want to go with them. A lot of people are like on the on the fence of LS swapping it. And I'm like, man, let, let's actually try something new. <laughs> Nobody has done this before. I've seen a couple pictures, somebody with a turbo on the L31, but I haven't seen no running pictures of anybody doing stuff. So, I mean, this could be the first. I know. This could be exactly. the last. <laughs> exactly. Last time somebody ever boosted five. I know. Like, you, know, you know it's going to blow yeah, up. Yeah, for a reason. Exactly. That's probably why. But other than that. So we just put on uh, the blow valve and you can see, dude, this looks amazing, dude. Holy crap, this thing looks like a boost motor. But it is a boost motor, but it actually finally looks the part. It's on through performance. And then, I mean, you guys, you guys to see how good this eBay so-called quality is. It's not really, it's, like I said in the previous yeah. video, it's not like cheap eBay, just like no name, random Chinese stuff. It's like, there's still a name to it. It's still Chinese parts, but like there's a name to it. So I mean, people wouldn't sell crap if they have their name on it, but. I guess you get to test it out, see how, see how well it does. If it blows or if it acts stupid or something, you just go get a, a like a precision turbo one. Exactly. So, I mean, this is just, I don't think a blow off valve would like cause the motor to explode. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong. You know, everybody, in, everybody in the comments is experts. So. Exactly. In fact is, you can't do this, you can't do that. Then I did it and it works. Then like, okay, this, uh, I get a dislike, dislike on the video. Exactly. <laughs> dislike the video yeah, because I proved them wrong. I'm like, okay, okay, okay. That looks cool. Yeah, but. That looks beast, dude. Holy crap, I'm so jelly right now. Like, I want to see this on my car. I want to see this freaking blow valve on there and the intake piping. See, you got all this high-end stuff. Lipstick on a pig, basically. So, 350 small block with intake, 80-pound injectors, long tubes, intake, 98-millimeter LS throttle body. Oh, God. Holy this crap. So much, I almost forget it. Boost Everything reference okay. FPR. So much stuff. AEM um, piggyback FIC. Holy crap, dude, you got so much stuff in there. Then you have the stock alternator. <laughs> this is, this is, <laughs> How can you live with yourself? Exactly. I'm gonna replace it, yeah. it better. AC delete. Make it all look fresh. Yeah, AC, and need to paint yeah. Those headers too. AC delete in Louisiana because that's that's smart. Exactly. You know? Yeah, you know when it's 90 degrees outside, you know, and this is your only only vehicle. Yeah, let's let's delete the AC. It makes sense. <laughs> but oh my god, this thing looks amazing. Holy crap, I gotta get some more shots. Holy crap, I'm about to put some crispy cinematography in this. Oh, oh my god. Wires, though. Oh yeah. I need to wrap them things up. Hey man, look, the engine is beast, but the wiring though. Do something about that, do man. Do something about that, man. It's gonna lose performance. <laughs> okay. So this basically should really be the final setup of it from intake, blow off valve, got the coupling, the four to three coupling right there, going all the way down. You can kind of see it in the wheel well a little bit if you can see it right there coming all the way down that's it we just got to measure the run from here all the way to where it connects back there to the actually, turbos I have, i'm actually i have a straight uh bridge piping in there we actually could connect the thing it's just i know it's gonna blow off i'm not I'm why why why, why would it blow off though because it doesn't have the uh bead around it to, to help seal the coupling oh uh, it's, it's oh it's flat it's flat yeah, it's not beaded okay yeah. all right see, yeah but um yeah so we can't really test it right now. We'll have to go order the part for it. So it's just a long beaded, not be, what, what would it be like a, a ridged or something? You see how the end of that is? Yeah, you see how the end of that has that little flange on there? It's like it's kind of built in. We just need another one of those that runs from here all the way to the back of the turbos. And once you get that, put the couplings on there, we're gonna be boosting. So dude, like we're like there, like 99.95% there. And this part is only like what 40 bucks online. We're probably gonna overnight it or something. Not overnight, but you know, too cheap to overnight. And see, look, both of these already have the right ends on it. If I just cut both these flanges off and bring the welder and have them weld that together, this might what? be long enough. It's possible. Want... I have another one. I have three of these. What? So it's possible. Uh, I mean, it's, up, it's, it's whatever you think it will actually work. It costs less than. Yeah. Uh, 
buying the full piece? Why yeah. not? I mean, you already have the materials here. Mm -hmm. I guess you can try it. It's very close. I'm, I'm gonna need a third one. Uh. Yeah, it's gonna be two welds. So they charge me like. I don't know about sixty dollars. I got sixty bucks on hand right know, now. Maybe better to get the yeah, but hey, it's sixty bucks for that or sixty bucks to get a brand new exactly. one, one full, full piece. piece. That's the whole thing some, about that. Somewhere else. Yeah, but use all your car when you boost your car. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, save those for me. Yeah, you know, they have those on standby, little things like that. But overall, dude, this all we gotta get. That's what we just gotta get the freaking um yeah. the other will run and we're, we're done. Oh, dude, you can see it from right here. You can like slightly see the, the blow off valve. And it looks amazing. You can see it. <laughs> I know, dude. Holy crap. If you open your engine bay and people are like, oh, this is a stock L31. Holy crap. It's like, nah. what is this? What is this big old thing right there, man? The sundial. <laughs> All I'm going to do is get a fresh alternator, make that look nice. This whole freaking, I don't know, crossover for my fuel rail. I hate the way it looks. I'm gonna make it uh, go straight across where it's flat. Mm -hmm. And there's a neck, the little water neck for the uh, heater core or whatever. Make a nine. I want all this stuff to be low profile. All you see is straight intake. Yeah. And all those wires I'm gonna cover all over the big plate. Oh, heck yeah. It's gonna oh. I'm done with it. Dude, this thing looks so built right now. Yeah. And it's stock bottom, man. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Oh, yeah. It's... Gotta run stock bottom in. I know, dude. Be like everybody oh else. my god, this thing is beast. You guys better subscribe. The next video is gonna be beast. Next video, I swear, I keep on saying next video is gonna get boosted. I swear the next video is gonna get exactly. boosted. So then people think I'm lying now. I'm not lying anymore. I used to lie. I used to lie. And now I'm a changed man. I'm born again. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. <sighs>